In this example, we will solve a system of equations using a graphical approach and then verify that we get the same result using elimination. Convert each equation to y equals mx plus b so they can be graphed easily. In the first equation, bring 2x to the right side and then divide both sides by minus 1. This gives y equals 2x minus 8. In the second equation, bring the 5x to the right side, then divide both sides by minus 3. This gives y equals 5 over 3x minus 7. The green line is y equals 2x minus 8. The blue line is y equals 5 over 3x minus 7. The point of intersection is at 3 minus 2. Now we'll use elimination to see if we get the same result as graphing. Rewrite the two original equations. Observe that the x coefficients in each equation are 2 and 5. If we can somehow convert each of these coefficients to the lowest common multiple, which is 10, then we can get the x terms to vanish. Multiply both sides of the first equation by 5 to get an x coefficient of 10. Multiply both sides of the second equation by 2 to get an x coefficient of 10. Rewrite both of the equations after multiplying. We can either add or subtract to eliminate x. In this case, subtraction is required to make the x terms vanish. Ten x minus ten x is zero, so the x term is gone. Minus five y minus minus six y is one y, and forty minus forty two is minus two. Now plug y equals minus two into either equation. We'll use the first one, two x minus y equals eight. Plug in minus 2 for y as shown in the animation. The double negatives become a plus, so we get 2x plus 2 equals 8. Bring the 2 over to the right side, giving 2x equals 6. Divide both sides by 2 to get x equals 3. The point of intersection is at 3 minus 2. This matches the solution in part A where the system was graphed.